It's Friday, which can mean only one thing. We gotta go upload a video. And Mariana is the secretary. Head of secretary. Gotta put her to work. Pack up that bag. Get that yes, computer. Sir. Yes, boss. So uh, I'm going to leave Nadiana to work out and I'm going to get cracking on the other winch. Another thing that I need to do is write a list of things to buy on Amazon. But uh, it's not really that good for DIY stuff. Um, there's loads of stuff that I need that I just can't find. You always come at the wrong times. You always come at the wrong times. Okay, shave time, cowboy style. What's that? We don't take kindly to folk like you around here. <laughs> now it does look like you have excessive nose hair. <laughs> <laughs> well, it came to an end. We have to share an apple. <laughs> No, I'm just joking. We're still, we're, we're okay. Don't worry too much. Look, a star. Is that for your star of a husband? Yeah. Oh. We're only sharing the apple because, uh, because of my thoughts that I think we should go to the supermarket with efficiency and we're trying to use all our stock now and I would plan to go to the supermarket on Monday to get lots of stuff again and maybe it's a way to keep other people safe too and us safe it's saturday now uh last night the video went up and uh, i asked for your advice about the samsung post and most people said it's not a good idea to do some people said it's fine um, as a temporary job which is what it would be anyway really um but let me just tell you a couple of extra bits of information here is the top of the Samsung post right and you can see this is a big old piece of wood which is fiberglass in so you've got two layers of fiberglass the big piece of wood that comes into here that is where the windlass is bolted in now there's plenty of material between the top of the Samsung post here to where it comes out on deck now another reason why I want to get it sorted is because due to the really dry weather um, the top of the Samsung post and where I had kind of epoxied it with some all-purpose glue has now cracked so there's um, it's I'll go and show you you can see so as you can see the wood see I filled it in with wood and wood chippings and it's kind of cracked down the around the edges here I noticed it when I was led in bed and I could see the light shining through so I, I mean I can just seal that it's not gonna rain for a while so I, I've still got some time to think about it. I can just seal that and then leave the whole thing till I get a new piece of wood or I can uh, do my plan <laughs> but there's plenty more jobs to do got these top winches which need uh, doing I've already done this one and it's spinning really nicely. So this bit's pretty much fixed and you have these which I've looked are called poles. Got three on the top, four on the bottom and they're all pretty, they're not too bad. Just a little bit dirty so I'll give it a clean and uh, a little oiling and then they'll be good. Mm. 
not getting any load. <laughs> I can't believe how much we're there. Is it normal? It's just that it's just because the pump can't pump everything out. Oh. And you are. It is normal to have a leak, but this is like a bit too much, really. Mm. When we wash as well, when we wash the boat, it. It leaks through to the belch. some new stuff believe it or not we only had the cheap free paper ikea tape measure now we've got a real tape measure a metal saw which i also like using metal saws for wood too i've got some blades coming as well and some cigaflex this is the caravan stuff but it's 512 which is multi-purpose, so it's all good. Babe, hey. do you want the last pickle? <laughs> I, I'll let you have the last pickle. I don't no, mind. you can have no, it. No, no, no. I, I had the other one. I realize it's not, I think I actually scared of going out. Maybe that's why I'm trying to like say that oh we should eat all the stocks but maybe I'm just really scared of going out. Have a look at my tomato sauce rice with last of everything. <laughs> bloody cats come on the boat with a bloody mouse. Where is it? You better get that. You better bloody get that mouse, mate. Where is it? It's got it there. Oh no. It's just playing with it. So I separated the cat and the mouse. The mouse was in shock but it was still walking around. The cat had not even, didn't look like it had done too much damage. I took the mouse off. You should probably kill the mouse because apparently they're vermin but um, I just went and left it out in a bush. Me and Nadiana are just going to the supermarket. It's absolutely freezing in the morning. For the first time in two weeks. Hopefully there won't be any long queues and we'll have lots of products to choose from. I said our stock can last us three, four months, but it only lasts us for two weeks. But it's because we're eating quite a lot. No queue. Good stuff. Not many people here at all. We just got back from the supermarket and got so close to be fined. Uh, there were two policemen checking uh, the certificate and we both got it and everything is perfectly ticked and filled in he didn't even look at ours he talked in French of course but then we could understand and we say oh so sorry we don't speak French do you speak English and he said no but he like slowed down in French and tried to explain we understand it which he was saying that we cannot walk together it cannot be two person so can only be one at home, one, <laughs> one go to the shop. He said, like, just remember and then let us go. <laughs> I guess next time we will just have to walk two meters apart. Everything's got to have a double use on a boat. So we're using our isolation papers and it creates, it diffuses the light. So there's no like harsh light streak coming through. And it's actually really pleasant. So maybe it would be good to have like, instead of shutters and curtains, 
light diffusers. Take a look at our newly stocked boat. <laughs> I'm pretty happy because uh, my worst nightmare wasn't true. The supermarket are really well stocked with fresh stuff and everything, eggs. Mark now is fully prepared for the virus. Fully prepared to have a little play around with the Samsung post because it's got fiberglass underneath it and I don't want to take any risks. I'm just going to take away the crispy fiberglass and then see if I can wiggle the post through. Free. Despite a lot of advice not to do it, I think I'm going to do it because I've had good advice to do it from two guys who build their own boats and said it's not a bad thing to do. Let's have a look at what Mark is doing. How's it going babe? Not very well. Alright, now that's it for this Friday's video and I'm sure a lot of you are thinking why on earth has he started that Samsung Post job? Could have just left it. Well, I have proceeded with it. Um, it's not finished yet. What I am going to do is put that video on as a coffee only video. So if you really want to see me doing an amateur job of the Samsung Post, you'll have to sign up to our coffee unfortunately. The reason why I'm doing that is because I'm not sure if I can take the amount of criticism uh, for the bad job so um, that's that's what's gonna happen with that one that video I'm not sure when that will go up. that will go up when the post is finished so uh, next week sometime but other than that we'll see you on Tuesday for the next video thanks to everyone for all your support see ya